when I talk about the TAP program. So At the end of 2013, the Air Force announced its plans to reduce the force by 25,000 airmen over the span of five years. Whether you're looking forward to the transition or dreading it, being prepared for a life outside of the military is key. The Airmen and Family Readiness Center holds the Transition Assistance Program to help ease the shift from service member to civilian. The whole concept be behind the TAP program is educating people, educating them about what their benefits and entitlements are, educating them about how to write a resume, how to negotiate salary, how to go on a job interview. So, and then we also have some classes outside of that for resume writing for people that are looking for federal employment. You know, knowledge is always power. That's not going to change, so the more information that you have, hopefully that will lead you to making you know, the best career choice. Having a plan can mean the difference between a new job and unemployment, but you don't need to wait until the end of your military career to create one. Having a plan as soon as you come in is going to be a good idea for anybody starting now because having a reductions in the military doesn't happen only once in a lifetime and you never know when it will happen again. So you need to be prepared when you join the military to have a plan just in case it doesn't work out. Unforeseeable circumstances are inevitable, but you don't have to be blindsided. The more knowledge you arm yourself with, the better equipped you'll be to face future challenges and adapt to your new life. Airman First Class, Anastasia Denman, Scott Air Force Base, Illinois.